Hi everybody, welcome back into our channel. This is Nikki and it's so good to be here with you family. I'm gonna dive right into this video because I want you to understand why people treated you like you were mediocre. I want you to get it in your spirit and know why people treated you like you were nothing. People treated you like you were nothing family because God hid what he put on the inside of you. God hid what you were carrying. God hid all that power that you were carrying. God hid all of that anointing that you were carrying. He wouldn't allow you to be exposed prematurely because God had to let you know what person and what entity that you had walking with you, family. This is why God hid what you carry. Anytime you've chosen to do something great in this world and God sees that another person has different plans for you, when God sees that the person that you're connected with has a hidden agenda where you are concerned, God is going to start preserving you in a different way. He's going to conceal things from that person because he's not going to want that person to know what he has or she has access to. God hid all of those things that you carried because God was going to expose the true heart of this person. God was going to expose the true character and integrity in people. Anytime a person can't get what they want out of you, family, whenever they want it, and whenever you say no, that's going to expose the true character and that's going to expose the true integrity in that person. God hid your treasure because he knew what people were seeking when they came in your life. Everyone that comes in your life, family, is not for you. It doesn't matter how they talk, how they sound. It doesn't matter, family. You have to just pray because the enemy is very cunning. We don't give him credit. We don't praise him. We don't glorify him. But we have to be wise. We have to understand our enemy so that you can stay to the top so the enemy does not defeat you in an area where you don't have knowledge in because if you don't have knowledge in an area of your life the enemy can defeat you and he is going to defeat you if you love God or not God said I hid what you carry God said I hid that intentionally God said I hid that on purpose because I wanted to let you know the true heart and the true integrity of that person that has been walking with you for so long. So many people are waiting on you to get blessed, family, so you can get them out of a tight spot. So many people are waiting for you to make it so they can ride your coat till God said the devil is a liar and the truth is not in him. God said, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. God said, I'm going to preserve your blessing. God said, I'm going to pres preserve your miracle. God said, I'm going to preserve your breakthrough. He said, I'm going to put it on hold for you until we resolve this issue with this evil entity walking right beside you claiming to be something that they're not God said I'm going to prove this to you God said I'm going to allow this person to show true face to you God said I'm going to allow this individual to show you who they really are and what is in their heart God is going to reveal to you the true intentions of a person's heart and he's going to reveal this to you by hiding and preserving what he put on the inside of you God had to preserve what you carried because he had to show people up that you thought were with you. The person, the people that you thought were with you, they were not with you for the reason that you thought they were with you. They didn't have good motives. They didn't have good intentions. So this is why God hid what he put on the inside of you. The greatness that you carry, God hid that. He hid all of that. God hid your power. He hid your anointing. God hid your blessings. He hid your breakthroughs. He hid all of these things. Everything that God put on the inside of you for a season in your life. Whenever you are connecting with the wrong people, God is going to hide it every single time. He did this for you. He hid what you carried for you. He concealed what you carried, family, so the devil wouldn't use you up. So the devil would not take the best years of your life. 
The devil came to take the best years of your life. The devil came to leave you bankrupt. The devil came to kill, to steal, and to destroy. Every good and perfect gift comes from God. But you better believe that the enemy wants everything God gave you. He wants to leave you with nothing. This is why you can't play around with the enemy. This is why you can't paddicate with him. You know, a lot of people are playing games with the enemy, but the enemy is not playing games, family. He's coming. He has a threefold ministry. Kill, steal, and destroy. God hid everything that you carried because people that are walking with you, people that are connecting with you, family, these people are not who they say they are. God is going to snatch the mask off. God is going to uncover things that people try to conceal. The Holy Spirit is going to reveal it. Before you walk into this next season of breakthrough in your life, every person that you thought was for you, God said, I'm going to reveal it to you. Every person that you thought was there for you who really was rooting for you God said I'm going to show you who these people are I'm going to show you who this person is God said I'm going to do that for you because I cannot afford for you to abort your destiny God can't afford for you to abort that family so God had to hide what you carried he hid it a lot of people were waiting on that to be revealed and a lot of people got tired of waiting, family. They got frustrated. But this was the plan of God to wear your adversary out so they can walk away from you. So that they can get so frustrated and aggravated with you that they would think that what they wanted from you, it just was not going to happen. You know, God allowed people to look at your life like you were going to fail and you would never get back up. God hid what you carried. God hid the plans that he had for your life for a reason because family the integrity of people he had to expose. God had to expose the character in people that didn't mean you any good. When people have poor intentions for you, when people have poor motives for you, when a person has a hidden agenda with you, they're going to be very impatient with you. And over time, you're going to see it, family. Their mannerisms are going to be different. They're going to talk to you different. They're going to be short spoken with you where they weren't, where they will be snappy with you, where they would, where they would have patience with you. The enemy is going to rise up in people. And you may be asking yourself, who is this person now? What happened to this individual? The true person has manifested. God said the true entity in this person has manifested. The spirit that you thought was in this person, God said it was not the true character in this person. It was not the true integrity in this person. This is why God hid what you carried. This is why God allowed your blessings and your breakthroughs to be on hold. This is why. Because a lot of people came in your life to piggyback off of you and God knew it. God loves you so much. God loves us so much that he's going to always do what's best for you. God know why people are connecting to you, family. Waiting on you to get blessed. A lot of people are waiting on you to make it so they can make it. And when you make it, and then when they pull from you, they're going to walk out of your life, family. And they're going to take your blessings, family, and go on about their business. These are opportunists. But God said he hid what you carried on purpose. God said he hid what you carried intentional. God is intentional when he blesses you. And God is intentional, family, so that you don't make a mistake to think someone came from God. You got to know when God sends you somebody. And you have to know when the enemy is sending you somebody. You can't ignore the red flags and you can't ignore the signs. You can. These were bloodsuckers. These were leeches. These people were spiritual leeches that was assigned by, by evil. They were assigned by the kingdom of darkness, family, to set your life all the way back. The enemy knows how close you are. You remember that. When you get in a tight space, whenever you get in that tight, tight spot, when you want to throw the towel in, when you want to give up, family, you remember why you started. You remember what the end is that God promised you. You remember the vision. You remember the end. Just know God hid what you carried. He hid what you carry to expose the true nature in people. God hid what you carry so he can expose the true integrity and the true character in people. Sometimes you think people are for you and God has to show us different.
He shows us different because God knows the heart he gave us. God knows you might have good intentions toward people. But do you understand that people don't always have good intentions toward you? And this is what God has been trying to show you. This is what God will show you whenever you have the wrong people around. Whenever you have the wrong people in your environment, God is going to show you more ways than one. So listen and take heed to the voice, to the warning. God is revealing the things that people try to conceal. That mask is coming off. That fakeness that people have been showing you, that's coming off. That smile that they show you, but it really is a frown behind that. God say, I'm snatching the mask, mask off of you. I'm going to let my child know who you are because God knows you. God knows you mean well, and he knows people don't mean well by you. God knows that. So this is why God hides. This is why God conceals the gifts, the callings, the blessings, the miracles that he's going to do in your life so that he can expose the true heart that people have toward you. God said, the king heart is in my hand. God said, I'm going to turn the king heart in your favor. What people meant for evil, God said, I'm going to make it good for you because you are mine. You belong to me and you are called according to my purpose, not my own, not your own. You've been bought with a price. You've been redeemed by the blood of the lamb family. God bless you. We love you here. We're praying for you. Thank you for what you do on our channel. Don't you get scammed. You see the scammers in the comment section. You see these replies. Delete them. I am not reaching out to anybody. Just delete the reply family. When you get a notification with my picture icon, a fake picture icon, WhatsApp, you all delete these things. Don't let these things linger in your spirit. Don't let these things linger in your space. Don't do that. Delete the devil. Delete it. We love you. God bless you. We'll talk later. Bye-bye.